Hey everybody, meteorologist Rose here. We've been talking about that ice storm primarily happening to our north, but we want to give you a glimpse of what we're really talking about when we say ice storm. All year we cover all different types of precipitation, whether it be snow, sleet, freezing rain, or even in the form of rain. But what exactly does freezing rain look like in the atmosphere? Well, initially it starts off as snow in the upper levels of the atmosphere. And as it's continuing to fall, it hits a layer of warm air where it transitions back into rain, all rain. Right before hitting the surface, it runs into another thin layer of cold air. And that's when it transitions into freezing rain. That being said, it starts to freeze onto hard surfaces, roads, trees, and power lines, which can create a lot of destruction. We want to give you a glimpse of what this looks like with a little experience, so we have some dry ice here. Safety per safe for first, we're putting on our gloves. We have moved the dry ice onto another plate. Let's see if we can get this. And the plate is now extremely cold, like you would expect roads and trees to be. Once we factor in this rain, you notice we put this around in a nice thin layer. All of this moisture will start to freeze instantly. As you notice, you can take a closer view, and that's exactly what's going to happen on some of the roadways. You notice all of this is already frozen upon the surface, and this is one of those reasons why we strongly encourage people, if they say travel is not advised, to not get out of the ways. We'll have more in your local forecast. Talk about the impacts that we're going to see here as well, coming up.